Well, hello and welcome to my channel. Today we are going to be going through my favorite item of this month. I have a wide selection of items for you guys, ranging from beauty products, home goods supplies, office supplies, and clothing. Now, before we dive in, make sure you guys like and subscribe because I come out with content every single week. And let's get into this. We're gonna start off with my favorite bathroom items. So for me, bathroom items are very specific. And when I find an item or a product that I like, I stick with it. Now I have been using the St. Ives Oatmeal and Shea Butter Body Wash for probably close to 10 years, just because it smells amazing, it lathers really well, and awesomely enough, it is plant-based, it's cruelty-free, and it's also made out of recycled plastic. For years, I was terrified to admit, I had no idea how to wash my hair, okay? They say, exfoliate your scalp, rub gently, don't use your nails, do this, do that, okay? Simmer down, I don't know what I'm doing, but, this thing, the little Max Soft Hair Scalp Scrubber, it is perfect. It allows for you to really get every inch of your scalp. I think it's a game changer. I think everybody should try this. Go for it. It's like five bucks. After my shower is lotion. I'm obsessed. There is no other lotion in the world besides the bum bum cream that I had in my previous favorites. I will link it up here for you guys. But this lotion is my favorite after a bath and right before bedtime. Now it is the Baby Johnson's Bedtime Lotion and this stuff smells like heaven. It goes on really smooth. All you need is a little bit and a little bit goes a very long way. Next up is going to be styling my hair. And a new favorite item of mine for my hair is actually the BB Hairdresser's Invisible Oil. And this stuff is amazing. It has a very subtle smell. It smells sweet, but not too sweet. And it's not a heavy oil. I use about one pump and I haven't gotten a haircut in close to a year, but look at how, I mean, it's not super healthy, but look at how healthy the ends look. They're not too bad, not too shabby. So I highly recommend the BB Hairdresser's Invisible Oil. Now, when it comes to cleaning my face, my face is extremely sensitive to breakouts and harsh chemicals. So I found the Neutrogena Naturals to be the most gentle cleanser on my face. And when it says naturals, it is the most natural facial cleanser I've ever seen. And the ingredients, they list them here and right across you can pinpoint exactly where each item comes from. I think that's amazing. After I've put on my Neutrogena Naturals onto my face, I like to use the Vanity Planet Facial Scrubber. Now this facial scrubber comes with three different brushes, I guess you could say. It comes with a daily brush, a soft brush, and an exfoliator brush. I have had this brush for almost two years. My face has never been this healthy. And I really do mean that. I feel like this has changed and stepped up my self-care routine to a new max. It's a little bit pricey. If you ever get the chance, if you save up enough money, go for it. It is just the best way, in my opinion, to clean your face especially because it has the different brushes. I have found a holy grail face mask. Now this is the Origin Origins Clear Improvement Active Charcoal Mask. So it is the type of mask that you put on your face after you've washed it and you leave it on for about 10 minutes or until it's dry and you wash it off gently and I have got to say, I've never in my life had a face mask that, if it's a wash off, has not clogged my pores. And this is heaven sent. I've tried the cheap $2 charcoal masks, the Ulta brand masks, the Sephora brand charcoal masks, and this is the only one. Now this one is a little bit pricey for the amount that you get, but a little bit does go a long way, so I cannot recommend this enough. Try it, try it, try it. Comment below if you've tried a similar one or any other Origins face masks. I would love to try them out. Now another favorite face mask of mine is a recent find. It is the Laneige Water Sleeping Mask. Now this is a mask where when you open up, I don't know why I didn't think about this, but it's a jelly mask. It comes with a little scooping spoon thing to keep bacteria out of your mask and off your face. And if you guys can see this, it is basically like a little jelly. 
I don't know how else to describe this to you guys besides it smells incredibly clean. Like it feels like I'm putting a freshly cleaned house on my face. And when I woke up the next morning, my face was unbelievably soft. Go try it for yourself. Perfume is something that I have never really gotten into. I always thought it was like a waste of money until I found this. This perfume is amazing. I found this perfume at Marshalls years ago and I don't use it very often, but when I do, I smell like a snack. And I do mean that. This stuff smells super fresh. It is my favorite probably year round scent. This is my first perfume I've ever owned, so I can't really say much, but it is highly worth it. I am so happy that I bought this when I did. This is the most recent purchase of mine, and it is Poo-Pourri Before You Go. Now this stuff I thought was a joke, so I decided to try it out. This stuff is fantastic. It'll change your life. It'll make your bathroom smell amazing. You could probably go into Taco Bell, spray this in the toilet, and the whole room would smell like a luxury bathroom. This stuff is amazing. So now I have home items. My first candle is going to be the DW Honey Pumpkin candle. Now this candle is fantastic. All of their candles are soy candles and this one smells like a freshly baked pumpkin pie that has honey in it or caramelized honey. Now this one is 9.9 .9 ounces and on their website is about 12 to 13 dollars but at Marshalls and TJ Maxx you can get it for six to seven dollars. That's 50% off. Now my next favorite candle, it is the vanilla latte and it smells like the taste of a vanilla bean frappuccino from Starbucks. This smells amazing. It really does smell like a soft vanilla latte and it pleasantly fills the room. Let me know what your favorite candle scent is as well as if you've tried the DW Home brand. Give me some recommendations. I I need some more candles. Now, because I'm in front of a screen a lot more than I would like my eyes to be exposed to, which means a lot of harsh blue light. These glasses have saved my eyes. And look how stylish they are. Yes. These glasses come in a pack of two from Amazon and they're amazing. One that I got is matte black and the other one, as you can see, is like a leopard print. I think one of the coolest features that it came with is a anti-Blu-ray testing card and it comes with a little light. Now when I shine this light directly on, it shows you the harsh effect and the burn and everything that happens to your eyes. That is what your eyes are being exposed to. Your eyes are literally burning. Let's try it with the glasses. Burn it, trying to burn it as long as possible. Look at that, nothing. I mean, some blue light is going to get through regardless, but these are fantastic glasses. Protect your eyes. They are one of the most amazing parts of your bodies and these glasses help. And also, these glasses make me feel cute. Now office supplies are something I never thought I'd be excited for, never thought that I would really get into, but it's so critical when you are an adult and you have all these random papers, random letters and important things that you need to keep such as finances, car things, health care, I don't know, important things. So a little control that I just recently got, it's so simple. It's a five document container with oddly enough only four labels. It fits a lot. I already have a buttload of documents and definitely going to be purchasing a second very, very soon. Now it may seem weird, but another favorite of mine is going to be pens. The Papermate Ink Joy Gel Pen. It comes in two different sizes and the colors are fantastic. These pens are amazing. They're super soft. I love the grip on them. They don't really bleed through paper. And my next favorite pens are the Pigma Micron pens. Now these are amazing. It is from, I believe the Sakura brand. These pens come in a wide range of sizes all the way from 0 0.01 all the way up to 0 0.08. This journal has really helped me compress my thoughts in the morning and start off on the right foot. It has two sections, a morning section and a night section. Now the morning section asks to reflect on three things that you are grateful for, three things that would make today great, and one daily affirmation or more if you can fit it. And at night, you can fill out the bottom part and reflect on three amazing things that happened that day, as well as what would have made today better. Moving on to my favorite section, we have fashion. Now, I am obsessed with this tank top. It is super cute. I have 
four colors. I have this color, a white, light green, and a black, and I am in heaven. So there's four things that I wish I could change about this tank top. The scoop is high, the straps are not adjustable, it comes in close together. It's really short. My belly button's here, and look how high, like I can't pull it any lower. But I do have to admit, they're so comfortable, and they even have a layer so that you don't have to wear a bra with it. My next favorite clothing item is these sweatpants. Now they are a little high, but the best thing is they're Sherpa lined. These are the most warm, comfortable sweatpants I've ever owned in my life. Just be warned, I have on the medium and they go up a little bit too high. Like they show off my tiny ankles and I don't really like that, but I do like the warm. And my last favorite item for you guys is going to be sunglasses. I have never in my life had a pair of sunglasses that fit my face. I can fit children's glasses better than adult glasses. And these glasses from Princess Polly, the Gemini, I believe, are my very first pair of sunglasses that I absolutely love. Not only are they super duper stylish, but they really work. Have you ever bought a pair of glasses that you put on to protect yourself from the sun and they don't work? Well, honey, you've got to try these out. These are amazing glasses, very high quality. I wish they made them in more style because this is the very first pair of sunglasses that fit my tiny head, so yeah. Well, you guys, that concludes today's video. I hope you all enjoyed. Let me know what some of your favorite items are or were from either this haul or this month. I would love to hear what your favorite recipes, beauty products, as well as favorite candles are because I love an excuse to smell a good candle. Bye.